Leading up to getting kicked out of the kitchen, the most problems was on the fish station. Yeah. I had two salmon come back but I didn't know where I was, so that's the problem we have. After entrees start coming in, there's no way. There is a way, I did it. That's okay. how you do that station. In my mind, Scott Lee should go home. I went down because he couldn't figure out how to communicate what you're supposed to do. I know I fucked up, uh, you know what I mean? Put it to a vote. I personally have to go Kevin and Scott Lee. Well, Scott Lee and Kev, you know, they're gonna own their stations. People put my name up because I had two things come back. You know, but what about the lack of leadership in anybody else? Chris, go ahead. Who's your two? I would say Scott Lee and Brett. Who wants a strong finish to the service? I'm going to get y'all two. Brett, you sent out the cold sauce. I don't even know what to say right now. I'm baffled. The fucking sauce. I'm not going home because of a cold sauce. Yo, so had there not been mistakes in dinner service, cold sauce would have got us kicked out, right? I'm just thinking, right? No. We wouldn't have been kicked out. No, we wouldn't no, have right? been kicked out. Right because I think me going up for elimination on a cold sauce behalf is fuckery, to be honest with you. Every Wellington was perfect. They weren't all perfect. Did that ruin dinner service? Well, it was that... one of many things, dude. I mean, okay, we, had, what we, was had the other thing? we had problems. Okay, was... What were the other problems, mother? Spit it out. Dude, I've been telling you what's on my fucking mind. There's a lot of big barking and no bite, Brett. If you want to talk to talk, like walk the motherfucker. I don't deserve to go up because of a cold fucking sauce. That's for damn sure. Fuck that. After the ladies of the newly formed blue team won the dinner service, the men of the red team must nominate two chefs for elimination. Red team, have you reached a decision? Yes, yes chef. Trev, red team's first nomination and why, please? First nomination for the red team is Scott Lee, chef. Garnish was one of the problems that we had this evening with timing and communication. Red Team's second nomination. Second nomination was... Kevin. Kevin, why? The salmons that came back, seemed like that's uh, when everything started to break down. Scotty, Kevin, step forward, please. Kevin, second time in a row. Why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? I got fight in me, Chef, and you know that. I'm not always yelling and screaming, but I'm a very confident person. I communicated very well, you know? I need to kick a little rust off, and this is definitely a wake-up call, Chef. Scotty, why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? I'm a good chef. I'm determined to win. I'm not here to lay down. Yes, I could have communicated better, but I didn't go down hard like how the fish station went down tonight. Fish station didn't go down hard. I had two friggin' things, you, you know? You didn't give me definite times. One okay. minute is eight okay. minutes, then going back, oh, I need okay. eight more minutes. Like, come okay. on. Garnish drives a ship. Everybody knows that. Everyone's always known that. You are the one that communicates. You can't say, I can't do it. What the fuck, you gonna give up? Chef, I got so much fire in me. You know, I'm not ready to go home. You know, I step up and say, yeah, I've I messed up. I fucked up tonight, Chef. But you know what? It's not over for me, and I know that. This is a very difficult decision. The person leaving Hell's Kitchen is... Kevin. Give me your jacket. I'm not feeling the desire. When you've got success outside this competition, and you are nowhere near as hungry now as you were last time you graced this floor. I wish you nothing but success. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you for the opportunity. Appreciate it. Thanks for coming back. Anytime. Good luck. Peace out. Eight long years I've been chewing on this. I came back for redemption. I already run several restaurants right now. So he's right. I didn't have that fire. I'm going to give my kids a hug and a kiss, and I'm going skiing. Scotley, back in line. I just want to make one thing very clear. Do not ever underestimate the importance of being passionate. When you give up, I'm going to give up on you. Understood? Yes, yes chef. chef. Get out of here. I have a bullseye on my head, but I'm going to make sure that I do everything to perfection so nobody can put the blame on me. I'm a strong chef. I know I'm a damn good leader. Our big brother's gone. Somebody's got to fill those shoes, and I'm ready for it. 
Kevin getting eliminated this early, a chef of his caliber, it is a wake up call for everyone to get their shit together or you could be next. Kevin was a standout in his first time in Hell's Kitchen. Unfortunately, this time around, he seemed more determined to head back to the ski slopes than to the Las Vegas Strip.